Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming back to the channel. Yes, we got Portia. Portia living her best life yeah she's asking the question how does it how how does it feel how does it how does it does it feel to be that bitch mm, mm, that bitch well one thing i can say i love those heels i love those heels i love the outfit even though i think it's recycled it's like i don't seen this very outfit this very ensemble somewhere this year on her now if you're balling like you say you're balling you shouldn't be dressing in the same outfit within the same year and you've been doing a lot of that portion a lot of that but you said your man your father time is a billionaire hmm and we've seen him recycle clothes as well too now i would say this would be a boss move yes i would say this would be a boss move if you were getting on that plane going to an excursion where it was just you yourself and i you know being one with the with the elements being one with you yourself but we know father time is somewhere in that clip and i i would gather to say he entered the plane right before you was entering the plane because you was trying to put your hand in your pocket but you had to catch those rails to get a aboard that plane mm -hmm. it looked like simon was uh right there in front of you i guess he was taking the photos of you i really don't know okay but that bag is cream portia you have on nothing that is cream you should have had a gold bag okay or you should have had a gray bag it would have been matching a little bit better but like i said you don't know how to dress your own self okay <sighs> we're not getting into fashion and trying to correct you that much because i've told you and simon once before how to dress y'all keep coming up with your own plans of action but it is a nice nice outfit done saw it before and um we don't saw the same shirt before it's on a different outfit i do believe so yes i think y'all are counting y'all pennies and trying to add them up to see if together collectively you both can be millionaires or billionaires all right you were doing just fine by yourself portia you were doing that boss uh, woman type work having your own companies uh entrepreneurship and you were working for somebody and making very lucrative money now what possessed you to go out on a limb throw caution to the wind and just set father time on face value okay don't know who would do that they got sense but we all know you are nothing by yourself and you're everything with someone else did i get that right y'all seems like it should be reversed but that's how Portia been balling these years she had to be with cordell she had to be married she had to have that perfect life we see how that worked out mm, divorce she had to be with Dennis. She had to make him buy her a ring. She had to make him commit. We see how that worked out for you. Hmm. Portia, you need to be in therapy somewhere. Instead of calling yourself selectively planning a three-part wedding. No, ma'am. No, sir. No, Lord. No, God. You need to pump the brakes. Get back to who you are, if you even know who you are at this mo at this moment. Because frankly, by looking at you with that cream bag, you don't know what you're doing. You don't know what you're doing because that's a fashion bomb mistake. You should have had the shoes matching the uh, purse. You see what I'm saying? You don't have anything cream. Nothing. Nothing cream. But that's neither here nor there we were talking about your state of mind what you're trying to do who you're trying to be out there who is Portia Williams is what you should be asking yourself is she a formidable 
Bowl opponent when she's by herself or does she need to have backup and have a man on her chest on her wrist on her waist hmm and why would you want father time I do not know it's not like you're a playboy bunny running around there and Hugh Hefner is there to support you because we knew what Hugh Hefner was being and what he was doing with his money he was showing the world baby girl he was having the Playboy Bunny matcher parties. And it wasn't nothing but men up there. And women probably dressed in hula outfits. But we know Simon ain't pushing and pressing no weight of money in that degree. Because if that was the case, wouldn't he be like Beyonce and Jay-Z? Have his own plane? Mm-hmm. He wouldn't be going to a hangar renting out a plane to fly you here, there, and everywhere. That wouldn't be it. But that's what he's doing. He also rent boats as well. Don't understand. Don't understand. Because we know he retired. Yes, he's renting out his space at his house to house cars. Now, I don't know if he invested in the Social Security Administration. But he can get money and claim it when he's 65 or 62. Because we know he's in the 60s. Even though he keeps saying he's 59, 58. Somewhere around there. But like a woman that don't want to give up her age. He's acting that way. And he's a man. There's a problem there. There's a problem. But girl. When you are one with yourself. When you are powerful making woman. That brings the whole table to the yard. And not the men, not the milkshake, but the whole table to a foundation that's built. Where you're going to have your own empire without the help of a man. So a man's supposed to add to you just like a woman supposed to add to the man. But you have nothing. You're saying to us you are nothing without this father time. Which is pitiful. Pitiful. And it's full of foolishness, fuckery, fraudulent. Fakery. Okay, we need you to get it together. Either marry the man. You don't have to have no three weddings. We could care less about three weddings. We want that first one to take place. Okay, and will it take place in Mexico? Really? Mexico? The same place that you tried to lock your baby daddy up in because you felt he had disrespected, put his hands on your cousin. Yes, we don't want to go down that road again because the only thing we saw at that little family portion matters. You were throwing plates, fire, uh, plates, forks, knives, silverware, boom boxes, mics, rugs, decoration off the table. Anything you can get your hands on. Because you that chick, you that angry chick we're talking about. That needs anger management 101 once again. Because evidently you have forgotten what you had to learn. And you haven't put that in your life today. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's where you are, Portia. Instead of you being that boss, that woman in charge of all her finances. And doing the darn thing with being an entrepreneur. As well as working for the man. You can have both lies simultaneously. But you threw caution to the wind. Because you thought you had caught the big fish. And for all the time. But to me. You caught a bad case of the blues. A bad case of the blues. But it's your life. You live it however you want to. I'll just be in popping in here and there. Trying to uplift you. Or trying to chastise you. Which one? I can do it. Doesn't matter. Because there ain't no love over here. But I hate to see a woman. They got. Well we're going to say the smarts. But you have the capability. Of learning. Something. To keep you in the business world. Um, I don't understand why. You feel you have to have a man. A man to say you got something going on. Because you're walking like you're a boss. You have two items that you produce for the consumers of the world. You have sheets, bed sheets, bed linen, and you have go naked hair that you seem to sport all the time. But some people on the download say that you are wearing somebody else's hair, not your brand, which you're selling to the masses. Okay. But that's all I have for this video. 
Guys, I just wanted to understand, or for my family to help me understand why this woman can't get this shit together. Okay, now I love them gray shoes. She should have had a gray purse to match that, and she would have been on fire. But right now, we wouldn't even run and let, we wouldn't even want to match, well, or strike a match, okay? Because it's not a hit and it's not fire. But Father Time was, I believe, right before her, before this particular video. Or not video, this particular picture. It damn sure ain't the same uh, plane he was riding on before showcasing, thinking it was his plane when it was just rented. Same with the boat that he partakes of. It was rented. Everything that Simon got is rented. All right. The house that he lives in now, it may not be rented. He may be making mortgage payments, but from allegedly. Portia name is not on it. Go figure. Go figure. But this man is supposed to love you, Portia. He's supposed to love you. Have your best interests and your heart. But it seems like another Cordell situation. That you're heading in head first. Not even thinking. Or jumping in head first. Not even thinking about your livelihood. And your daughter's livelihood. Yep. One thing Dennis was correct about. You don't be messing with no broke, broke, broke eagles. Okay. So he might have some short money going on. But I don't think it's long money. I don't think it's long money. And while he was retired doing him. What are you doing Portia? Are you making your revenue stream just in case it don't work out? Or if you get divorced. If you even get married. You're going to try to sue him for alimony. Is that what you're trying to teach PJ? Get them while it's good, and if they let you go, they're going to pay. Portia, 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 Portia. That's too much, girl. Too much. You're too beautiful. You're too intelligent enough or savvy enough to get nice jobs. But you threw them to the wind because you thought you had a millionaire billionaire who only has rented, has only showed us that he rents stuff. Mm-hmm. And that he have a moving van. In case you and him don't work. He got it on speed dial. But he don't even want to show his real face. Or you don't want to show his real face. And y'all still playing that auto-tune shit. Okay? Face tune stuff. Mm. So I guess y'all really do deserve each other. Y'all don't want to show us y'all real self. When it comes to photos. You got to photo shape the waist. You got to photo shape the face. That's just too much. Too much. But... This will be your second wedding. Hopefully you know what you're doing. Which we all say you don't. The majority of us say you don't. You're just hopping in your head first. And hopefully it works out. But that I don't know. You got people to think about. But then you don't. Because hey. Dennis got her. He got her locked. And he's teaching her very good morals. Values. And he putting her on a mission. Of being an entrepreneur person. When she gets older. He's instilling the good stuff. That you're not. You're stealing the how to let make a man take care of you. Really? That's how it goes? Mm. But that's all I got for this video, guys. And I will see you on the next one.